everybody knows somebody who made it to the NBA. And they feel like if they made it, I can make it. You know? You know, the odds is, you know, the odds is, it's just so hard for that to happen. So many things have to, to work. Select Anthony Davis. Did ask his mother about it, like, you know, how he felt or draft night. I wasn't around. I was home or something like that, and I did call her or whatever. And she said, personally, as a, as a parent, it's kind of hard watching, you know, and everybody got their hopes up and they watch the TV or whatever the case may be. Me, myself, I kind of just did something else. I don't want to sit here and watch this TV. Blazers select Damian Lillard of Weaver Harrison State. Barnes from the University of North Carolina. And you may be talented enough at the end of the day to become an NBA player, but that doesn't mean you're gonna make it. So then what? You know, are you considered a failure? Absolutely not. You're gone, New York. You want to be known as a gritty, tough guard that's not going to back down. You know, he fits in the line of those um, type of point guards, the, the, the Kenny Andersons, Omar Cooks. Walker, up the floor, Irving Walker. I'm leaving out so many, so many of them, they were just one thing that was linked them all together. They were not only talented, they were tough. Let's do it. BSLW Drake versus Lil Wayne F. It's actually a video game which is a collaboration with Capcom. That's the company that brings you Street Fighter and other games. So fans can select their city, pick a side, which is Drake or Lil Wayne. For me, I've, I've always been the smallest since I was young, so for me, it's not really a big deal. To hear the Nate say it sometime, that I think that gives me extra drive to, you know, want to prove people wrong. Like when I was little, fifth grade, all oh, went once you get to high school, he can't play. Once he's on varsity, he won't be as good. When you get to college, he won't. You know, so I, I, I was able to, you know, pass each stepping stone. And I think so far I'm doing a good job and just want to continue to get better. My dad used to go to the gym with these old guys and they play like some pickup ball. And it was this one young kid, by young I mean he probably was about 16 or 17 and he was good enough to, to uh, you know, play with them or whatever. And after the game I played him one on one, whatever, he let me score. I was about four maybe, I made a shot. I was extremely happy about that. Came home, bragged to my mom. But the younger kids we just, you know, had a group of guys and you played a couple teams, they made teams and you played. We lost the first game 8-4. My first ever game, I think I was five years old, but the kids were seven. I think they was seven, yeah. And we lost 8-4, I, I cried the whole way home. But one thing I can say about my parents, they never, never ever forced me to do something I didn't want to do. It was never that with my parents, it was more of have fun, keep them busy, keep them off the streets. Oh, I met Irvin, actually May of 2001. We were starting up a AAU program, and, and he was one of the first players that joined up. My son had seen Irv play in a couple of recreational leagues in Brooklyn, and he kept telling me about this kid, Irvin, Irvin, Irvin. He was able to make shots at an incredible rate for such a young kid. 
But if you can go overseas and you can make a million, still more money than you're gonna make, you know, working quote unquote normal type career. If the, the business sense is on right, they'll still try to pursue other avenues, you know, such as overseas and you know, if they can get that type of break, that's a, that's a good break to have. I remember when uh, Doc Rivers, he was watching Cali play a volleyball game. So this was back when Sebastian was on the Celtics. And, you know, I'm from New York. I thought Sebastian was basically like the greatest thing, you know? I'm like, yo, why? Like, we was talking about Sebastian and Ronda. We was basically debating. He goes, Sebastian's very talented, but he's no Ray Jean. And I basically told him, I said, you're crazy. You know what I'm saying? Boy, was he right, though. You know? Not because of his dedication or lack thereof while he's participating in the hardest, the, the hardest time for yeah. Irvin um, has been his not really getting a, a real opportunity in the pros due to his, his lack of size, not growing, because I think everything else is there. I think his style of play, I think, is, is suited. You know, because some people could have a lot of talent, but their talent just wouldn't gel in the NBA. I think his style and what he can bring, I think he would have really done well. But I think this, the, 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 the saddest thing is him not getting an opportunity, a, a real opportunity. So don't, you have to step away. Uh, whenever y'all in the game, this is who's rebounding. That's it. We don't, if we don't get a rebound, I'm never going to yell at these two. I'm always going to blame y'all. Every single time. Because if they get a long one, that's great. Long, if it comes back three point line, they don't get it. I'm mad at that. And yeah, he's getting sick rebounds in Pro City, so I don't know. I don't, I don't see why not him. They got to have And they all shoot the three. So we Defense on three. One, two, three. Defense. The rain is in. The rain is in. I'm getting ready, you know, I'm all packed up, head over to France for the next nine, ten months. 
you know, and pursue my basketball career in Dijon, France. You got to get an exclusive. You can't have it. You get them this is not where this stuff is. Just show me what you want. Now, I'm out. Yeah, I got the socks and everything. Just show me what you want. It's not one of those things where I'm put, I want to do well so I can get to the NBA. I want to do well over there for myself. And that, and if that comes along with it, I'm ha I'm definitely happy with that. But I'm not, like my focus is not on I need to make the NBA. Hello. Alright, I can't find no more. Alright, don't worry about it. Are you? You stressing for what? For you, for you, I'm stressing. No doubt, and I respect that. And when it beeps, is it on zero? It's not on. Nothing. You got press it. Press it. Okay, now lift it. And we should have did it from the side, but lift the whole thing. Lift off the ground, son. That must be more than what you lifted. Yeah, you lifted, man. I'm, okay, what, it beeped. What, it, what does it say? 50. I mean, I, I can't even say I was taught this. I'm just a firm believer of don't put all your eggs in one basket. And nothing in, like, nothing in is as great as it seems and as bad. And things aren't as bad when they're bad. You know what I'm trying to say. God has a plan for everyone, and right now, mine's is, you know, to play overseas in France. See, Mama knows where that. Where's that? Oh, yeah. What's that? What? Oh, that's how they record it? Yeah. You know, being away from home, and you know, away from your family and friends, and people may say, "Oh, you live in a dream. You're traveling the world." It's a spirit. He created a barrier of protection around him. He had many dreams on the cards. Yeah, but it's definitely it's not like you over there when you overseas like me I'm in France wherever other people may be it's not like you able to you're not on vacation going to party and just have fun and all those types of things it's actually a job you practice a lot you play you got you gotta eat right and uh, take care of yourself so it's not like a vacation where you two weeks you have fun and you leave and go back bye Naya Come give me a hug now. Yeah, actually, like, I'm over there more than I'm here, so they don't realize, like, it's an actual grind that mentally it gets tiring sometimes, and as well as physically. So you gotta, like, I'm prepared, you gotta prepare your mind and know what to expect. <laughs> Everybody looks NBA or okay. If I don't make NBA, we'll at least you know I'll go for a season, whatever the case may be. For me, it was more of a. Urban, I'm so proud of you. Just getting through school. You know, basketball is an everything. <laughs> don't make me cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm a big girl. I don't cry. Bye. I don't cry. Bye, Did you guys. say bye to your brothers? Please. Say hello, Miss Lady. Did you say hi to your brothers? <laughs> he don't care. He waits for you outside your room. You know that, right? I know. But I'm out. Okay. Later. See you guys.